Okay, so this is a new series, and we're going to start it really fast, because like I said in the last video, I gotta go to bed. Um, this is Shatter, it's a crossover, and you don't really need to know much about the crossover to get it, as long as you know about Mariah's Ladybug, because it's pretty self-explanatory, but yeah, I hope you enjoy. Um, yeah. Everyone had a breaking point, and although many never, although many never thought they'd see it, this was Marinette's. She was sitting in class, the back of the class, sketching. She never really talked anymore, just listened. Everything she said got turned against her, so she sat very quietly. This was until her old BFF came to her and poured coffee all over her and her sketchbook. It burned on Marinette's skin and her designs were all ruined. She was lucky she had defeated Hawkmoth because otherwise there would have been some serious consequence. You stole Lila's designs, Alia yelled. Marinette had tears in her eyes. She couldn't even respond, she just left. No one noticed how Nino pulled his phone out and started a text. Not many people knew this, but Marinette had a twin brother, one named Damien Wayne, and not many people had the honor of knowing they were related. But one thing was for sure, no one messed with the Wayne and came out unscathed. And no one but Nino, Kim, Max, and Alex knew about her brother, so Nino called him and went out of the classroom. He had broken up with Alia when she believed Lila over him, and now Chloe, Nathaniel, and Max were the only ones that stood with Mary. With Mari. Damon was sitting with his family having lunch on the weekend when he got a phone call. Normally he would ignore, but he recognized the name. It was one of his sister's friends. And he would make sure his sister was okay. So much to his family's surprise, he picked up. What is the meaning of this, Lahif? He said, bored, as he took a sip of his water, before spitting it out and standing up. He heard. Your sister is broken. And that is what made him do the extremely unlike Damien thing, to, such as spit out his water. Explain now, what happened to my sister, Lahif? Damien said with rage in his tone. His family all gasped at the word sister, but he was too infested to do anything about it. I mean, she isn't what she was. She is quiet and sad and lonely and needs help, he said. I'll be there in a few hours, Damien hung up. Father, we are going to Paris, Damien announced and started to head to his room to pack. What? Why? his father asked. My twin sister is not feeling at her best. I intend to help, with or without you, he said. So the Wayne family was on a jet to the capital of France not an hour later. They immediately were heading to a high school. You could see the rage coming out of Damien. If there was one thing that you would never doubt, it was that Damien Wayne would do anything for his younger twin sister. And so when he showed up and saw his little sister crying into a redhead's shoulder with a blonde pink head and nerd around her, as well as Nino, he was ready to pull out his katana. He went up silently and Nino whispered that they should let him through. So they did. He knelt down next to Marina and touched her back. Ochsi, he whispered. She immediately whipped her head in shock before leaping into him and resuming her activity. She cried in her older twin's arms. I'm so sorry I wasn't here before, Ochsi. He said in her hair as she cried. People started gathering at, at her new family in, at the new family in school and watched as one of the scariest hugged one of their students, even Lila and Alia. This was not going to be pretty. And that is where we're going to end it here. There will be a part two, and I really like the series, and I hope you guys do too because I'd be kind of upset if you guys didn't like it because I really want to know what happens next because. Like, you guys know me. I don't know what happens next. Well, I hope you know me. If you've been here long enough, you probably know me. I'm talking really fast today. Um, I have to go to bed soon. soon. Um, and so that's why I'm talking super fast. But today was actually really nice. Um, my mom's family is here, like I said. And tomorrow, my mom's dad, my granddad, is coming, which is super exciting because obviously I really love him. Um, and hopefully we'll do something for my birthday. My birthday was on the 25th, so it was a while ago now. Five days, actually, not that long, but um, almost a week, and so we'll probably do something knowing them, but, yeah, so that should be fun. Um, today, we actually did something with them. Um, my aunt, who lives here, she didn't really, um, we didn't, I don't know why, but as a treat, it was me, my dad, and my youngest brother, who is five, and her, went to the aquarium in Dubai Mall, which is a huge aquarium, by the way, um... And has the second biggest crocodile in the world. Um, so, yeah, it's a great aquarium. We went there. We saw some pretty fish. We saw some otters. We saw some frogs. We saw some crocodiles. We saw some crabs, jellyfish. Um, even some night creatures like, you know, bats, owls, 
um, like, different stuff like that. And, yeah, it was pretty fun. And meanwhile, my uncle and my other brother, who's 10, went to the VR park. I didn't want to go. I don't know. I was feeling kind of sick. I don't know. Like a stomach ache, a headache, like like a migraine. Like I didn't get much sleep. But I just had some Panadol and I was fine after that. So I hopefully get some good sleep tonight, even though it is pretty late because my brother is watching a Arsenal game with my uncle. Uh, those two are obsessed with football. Um, so, yeah, they're just watching the beginning half of an Arsenal game. And... Um, yeah, because we have to go to sleep. It's 10 p.m. And when you watch this, it'll probably be around two hours later. One hour, maybe. I'll push this as 11.30 and the other video at what would have been 10.30 if you're watching this. And yeah, I'm going to go now and I'll post pictures of the aquarium stuff tomorrow. But I have to go and I don't have time to put in pictures. Bye!